Magic in the dark side, nigga. Magic in the dark side. Let me stop playing it. <laughs> oh, if you smoke this up, you better light something up for this one. Let's get it. I'm gonna make sure this one is. Uh, let me see how much time I got on this. This is a YouTube exclusive joint here. Yeah. All right, cool. I could do seven on this one. All right. First of all, when magic first was introduced to the people, one one person would say that magic was something instituted by a group of angels that were fallen that were able to talk to mankind and give them a certain amount of magic arts. That's one story that came out. There's another story. I'm just giving you the stories, not really telling you what I believe. Uh, uh, what I believe is the asset story, but I'll tell you this much. There was this other group of people from the, the mountains some damn where that knew how to move these rocks and stuff because they just knew how to work certain different... There's a form of witchcraft that you manipulate certain parts of the fabric of the universe, basically different parts, different frames of the earth. And people who do that are like held in the highest, 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 highest. highest. Like, is the universe, you know what I mean? Like, you don't fuck with the universe. And, like, some people do that, and that's why they fall. Then there are others that are into these, like, dark rituals. Now, these are the, th this is the thing that I think is really bad. These little blood rituals and freaking sacrifices and mutilations and all these little candles and stuff especially worshiping the dark side especially worshiping satan those are all like false things and you know why they don't work because a lot of people have been praying that they don't work <laughs> you need to step your prayer game up and start praying to the gods that actually save instead of for the gods that put you in the grave speaking of the grave uh, yeah, I, I would go into Cyrus with that one. That's way later. Um, but let, let's, let's, the, <laughs> you have, now, a set, right? Uh, no, no, no. Before I go into a set, let's talk about the Lord God for a second. He said, suffer not a witch to live. And usually a witch is somebody who's in the dark arts, as in the way they're getting their power is from some free, some dark force of evil, and they only use it to do evil. That's why it's the chaotic. As they, they got these chaos magic guys, and you got your, you know, these, your warlocks and wizards and people who spell magic with a K instead of a C and shit. And you got all these guys that know how to do all these different things. But they're actually bending time and space. That's why Tahuti had a certain amount of rain over that. And they honestly believed that he had some sort of rain over magic. But it depends on what kind of magic it is. If it's physical magic where you actually have to use like some grain of dust and eye of newt and some other bullshit like that, then you, <laughs> you're obviously doing something evil. And if you don't, well, you know, more, hey, who, he whose faith you know what I'm saying? Like, God damn it. Especially if you're just straight up worshiping the, the devil. You know what I mean? You're not worshiping the God of heaven. You don't want to worship the God of heaven. You want to worship the devil? Come on. Then you got reptiles. Um, yeah, d is there a reptilian race of beings that, you know, shapeshift in the, in the White House? No. <laughs> um... Is it possible to have some species like that shit? Anything is possible nowadays, man. I mean, like, did you ever see V? That's a, that, there you go. And that was in the Reagan era. So you know somebody had to know something. You know what I mean? Then you have Satan. Satan is not a titan. Satan is the accuser. The reason why he's still kicking it and whatnot is because he... You see, when Lucifer had had it in his heart to be above the stars of God, right? He was the one that fell for that. Nobody else had to help him. 
when God had made mankind in his own image and told them to worship it, because see, this whole little tell them to bow before their feet and worship this that Adam, that only pops up in the Quran, but you notice it's starting to hold some sort of, it's starting to gain some sort of strength now. But uh, these, these angels, so-called, did not like mankind. All right, and Satan happened to be the main accuser. Satan's whole job is to accuse mankind. He was sent by. He wasn't really sent by David, but David knew that something like that could happen, where you could send Satan to somebody. It's in it's in one of the it's in one of the Psalms. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And uh, have a Satan sit at their right hand to persecute him. Day and night, accuse him of anything and everything. Job meets up, has a dealing with, has a falling out with Satan. You know why he has a falling out with Satan? Because Satan expected Job to say if he lost anything he had, because he made sure he. Satan always goes for your most prized possessions and tries to wipe them out, but he has to go through God in order to get any kind of power over it and God has set the limit you know what I'm saying that's how weak this dude is y'all niggas is over here talking about hell Satan come on man you, you. and like that that was the thing with idol worship a lot of people wasn't worshiping the actual deity they was worshiping the stone figure of the deity you know what I'm saying so we go from that to set set is my favorite character, yo. My, Set is my favorite character. You know why Set is my favorite character? Cause, like, Set is like a mix. He's the most evilest villain of them all. Not only does he take out the Egyptian version of, of Satan, which was out Pep, but he also is like the Judas and Satan put together. Some kind of way, with a little bit of bow in there. Some kind of, he got like a little bit of bow in there. But I'm just saying what he's like. I'm not trying to equate the motherfucker, cause like, that with according that with set is like they can't they can't touch this dude. He took he took out a pep, and that's the reason why Ray gave him a certain amount of clemency. So this is a bad motherfucker. He can start a storm. He 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 come to your house and put his feet on your couch. <laughs> Cause he said, "Bitch." <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> nah, man. He, cause, you know, when he betrayed, it was said that the way he betrayed Asar, Amun couldn't help him, Ray couldn't help him, Aset wasn't there, but she came there and still couldn't help him. Um. Sekhmet couldn't help him, and uh, Ta couldn't help him, and they all stood there and watched him. They was there. It was a big party. They all gathered together to to crown Asar the brand new king because Aset said he was the king. Because that's the thing that they they always take that from the woman. And I'm I, you don't have to believe me. Just get look it up, and you be the judge. Um. Ta and Osiris are like this. You're absolutely right. Amun and Ra are like this. Let me tell you why they like that. Hold up. I I I could go I could go to the next one. I could go to the next one. 